Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. As you can see, I just went to Starbucks. I got a vanilla sweet cream cold brew. I need some coffee right now, so this is gonna hit different. Mm. Lovely. They also messed up my order. I asked for an everything croissant breakfast sandwich and they gave me an everything bagel. So then they corrected themselves and gave me the sandwich basically for free. Mm. I also got a croissant for later. Today's video is going to be a... I haven't titled it yet, so I actually don't know what it's going to be. But probably like a getting my life together productive vlog. I'm going to take you guys along with me to run some errands. I just went to Starbucks because I needed coffee and a little something to eat. I need to go to the grocery store, just get some food stuff. I have a package to ship and it's like literally in the passenger seat with me right now. I also need to get gas, which I'm like really dreading because gas is so expensive right now. That is the plan for today. My nails, they're so grown out, but don't worry. I have a nail appointment booked for tomorrow, so I'm gonna get these refilled. Thank goodness, because they're starting to look a little crazy. And I'm gonna head to the grocery store now. I need to make sure to bring my list in with me. I will go crazy in a grocery store, just like buying food that I don't need. So here's my list. There's literally five things on the list. I'm betting money that I will walk out there with more than five things. Let's get to the grocery store. did my grocery shopping. I got everything I needed. Two more things I need to do. I need to go get some gas and then I need to drop off this package. It's like um, a birthday gift for my cousins. So of course I'm excited to send that for them. So far I'm doing pretty well on my errands checklist. I honestly love going grocery shopping. There's something really peaceful about going grocery shopping, specifically by myself though. I don't know, sometimes when I'm like with my family, I feel kind of rushed to like get the stuff that I need. I don't know, there's something really nice about just doing errands on my own. It's like my own schedule. I don't have to work around anyone else's schedules. I need to find my good playlist. I'm gonna do my car jams playlist because I got some bangers on that one. <laughs> Okay, I got gas. That's not gonna lie. The first time I've ever pumped gas by myself. I've either helped out my dad do it or I um, went to one of those places that they do it for you. It was a new experience, but I definitely need to start getting used to doing that if I'm going to be driving more, which obviously I wanna do. And now I'm gonna go to the post office. Alright, my package is shipped. It was $41. That's a lot for what I shipped. It wasn't very heavy. It was kind of a big box, not gonna lie, but it was not heavy at all, but I guess um, that's just how Canada Post is. Shipping is so expensive these days. There's like concealer on my face that I didn't blend out. That is so embarrassing. I don't know. It was like right here. Hopefully no one noticed, but let's get going. I also have to bring those groceries and I have a lot of like liquids. So I want to make sure that um, they're all going into the fridge, going into wherever they need to go. I'm gonna do a little grocery haul because why not? First up, we've got some cubed watermelon. It's almost summer and my favorite fruits are gonna be in season soon and I'm so excited. But for now, I got some watermelon chunks. I've got turkey bacon. I just love turkey bacon. And this is something that I've actually never had before, but I'm very excited. It is cran pineapple juice. I love cranberry juice. I love pineapple juice. 
So I'm hoping I'm gonna love this because cranberry juice and pineapple juice are like my favorite juices. So I got some cold brew, which is an essential of mine. And then because they were on sale, I got two types of Campbell's broth. I got the pork ramen broth and then the pho broth. I've tried this before. It's kind of okay. Like it doesn't taste like traditional, like real pho that we get from like a restaurant, but it's still okay. And then I got this pork ramen, which I'm very excited to try. I got some Greek yogurt. And then another thing that I've never tried before is this almond and oat non-dairy coffee creamer this is like the Starbucks one I definitely need to start getting non-dairy creamer because dairy really upsets my stomach but I eat it anyways like Greek yogurt Greek yogurt isn't as bad it's mostly like cream stuff so I thought I would try this creamer this is the hazelnut latte one I love hazelnut creamer because it kind of tastes like Nutella all right I'm gonna put these groceries away For lunch today, I decided to make some homemade ramen. The other day when I was at the Chinese supermarket, I found these ramen noodles and they look like the ones that you would get at a restaurant and I was so excited. So I got them and I also got that soup broth today, which is pork ramen flavored, which I'm so excited. So I made some ramen noodles. I added a soft boiled egg on top and it was pretty good, not gonna lie. The soup broth was not that flavorful. So I did end up adding a bunch of my own spices and flavorings into it. But other than that, it was pretty delicious and I'll definitely make Make this again I drank some cranberry pineapple with it and this is like such a good lunch Today is nail day. These are what the nails are looking like right now. I loved the set, but it's been, I think, exactly a month today. Definitely time for a refill. Um, I just woke up a few minutes ago, hence why my face and hair look like this. Um, but I actually got a package in the mail. This is from Sephora. I ordered a few products because I was just scrolling and I'm an impulse shopper, so. So I wanted to try out some Fenty products because I love Fenty. It's probably my favorite makeup brand. And there was a product that was on sale that I really wanted to get. These tiny scissors are not doing the job. I love Sephora because they give you little samples in every order. And so the main things that I got were the Fenty Beauty Body Lava Luminizer. It's like a body glitter and you can use it to just kind of add some shine to your body. Um, this is probably too dark as of right now because my skin is not tan at all and I'm actually quite pale, not gonna lie, compared to how I get in the summer. I can't wait to use that in the summer when I'm nice and bronzed in the sun. This will just give you like such a sun-kissed look, so I'm very excited to use that. I love this already and I haven't even like used it yet. And then I got one other thing from Fenty and that is, it's the What It Do Makeup Refreshing Spray. This is what it looks like. I love the packaging as well. I love the light purple. So I'm going to try this. I look... <laughs> I look so tired, which is accurate to how I'm currently feeling. That went right in my mouth. It's very misty, which is kind of nice. And I'm going to do my makeup quickly because my nail appointment is in half an hour and I'm getting picked up in like 15 minutes. So I need to put a little pep in my step here. The makeup turned out okay. I just did like a little light makeup. I really like the primer slash setting spray. Anyways, right now I'm just going to have a quick breakfast. I have biscuits here. We have these biscuits that my grandmother makes and they are so good. And I'm just gonna have it with some jam. 